is why I'm running, to protect that opportunity and that freedom that we came here for. I'm somebody who is actually committed to standing up against leadership. Hello and thank you for joining us here at Alpha News, your source for keeping up to date on this crazy election year here in Minnesota. In 2016, every state lawmaker is up for re-election and we're making every effort to bring you face to face with the candidates. Here's a look at two big endorsements coming up. This weekend is the Republican endorsement in District 51, which encompasses parts of Burnsville and Egan. The seat is currently held by DFL Senator Jim Carlson. One of the two candidates is Victor Lake. Lake is an immigrant from the former Soviet Union and a small business owner. Lake says seeing communism firsthand has greatly influenced his ideology. We escaped the grip of communism. We escaped the liberal policies, uh, the oppressive liberal socialist policies. and. Um, it definitely makes me appreciate not take this country for granted, not take the freedom for granted. And that's precisely the reason why I'm running, because I'm not happy with where we're going. My family is concerned uh, for the future of my children. Lake says he is pro-life and a Second Amendment supporter and says he wants to bring sensible solutions to Minnesota's transportation needs. I want to invest into our transportation and into roads and bridges so that we're all safe, um, but do it with the money we have. Um, with the surplus that we're projected to have. The endorsement convention is April 9th. The other candidate is Minneapolis police officer Chris Kelly, who had to reschedule his interview with Alpha News. Be sure to visit our website to learn more about both of the candidates. Next up is the race in District 20, which includes portions of Lesore, Rice, and Scott counties. The seat is currently held by DFL Senator Kevin Dahl. There are four candidates in this race. One of the candidates is 28-year-old Danny Petrichka. Petrichka is a graduate from MSU Mankato and works taking care of disabled Minnesotans. Petrichka says he is running because he thinks that the current leadership needs a change in priorities. We're not elected to keep majorities. We're elected to run on our principles and represent our constituents. And that's something that's more important than trying to keep a majority or getting Re-elected. Similar to Lake, Petrichka says he would change Minnesota's transportation priorities to focus on roads and bridges. Fix the roads, don't wait for an election year to do it. Do it when they need to be fixed, not waste time on a light rail. The other candidates include former vice chairman for a city council, Mark Bartusek, business owner Rich Dreheim, and former Air Forceman and statistician Bruce Morlin. The endorsement convention is April 11th. Be sure to visit us at alphanewsmn.com to learn a little bit about all of the candidates running in these two races and to stay up to date on elections in Minnesota. Thank you for joining us. I'm Julia Aaron with Alpha News.